Hello, my princess. I hey. I missed you. The old lady herself. My father, I missed you so much. I missed you too. <laughs> I thought you were supposed to be in your youth service camp. Oh. Are you done? Daddy, I'm tired. That place is hell. I mean, I cannot continue. You just have to sort them out, please. But you're looking real good. <laughs> You've been complaining, but you're looking good. Well, even at that, Daddy, that place is hell. I can continue. Don't please. worry, don't worry. We'll sort them out. What about mommy? Mommy is inside. Okay. I have to run now. I have a meeting to catch up. Aww, okay? Sweet. I'll see you. You know that you love it. Oh, I love you too. <laughs> Bye. Get something from me. I will. <laughs> 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 What are you still doing here, Mr. Manager? Why are you not at the factory? But Chief, you asked me to come and see you here by 2 p.m. And I've been waiting ever since. And you couldn't call to inform me? Uh, uh, Chief, I did though. Uh, but I've asked the security, the gate man, the kitchen attendant, and everyone. I was told you were busy. So I decided to wait. Look at, look at this man. Uh? Take a look at yourself. If I were to give you one million naira dash, couldn't you have reached me? Huh. Answer me, Mr. Walaka. Huh? See your life. You are just inefficient and very selfish. Oh. Sorry, sir. Um, anyway, huh? I went through your annual report last night. Huh? It's appalling. Huh? How can you make such a meager amount of money in a whole year? Huh? Uh, but chief, you know manufacturing takes a little time to break even. And besides, much of our investment went on machinery and that of fixed assets. I have even... Enough, my friend. <clears throat> Some of you think you can read business in school. With all your degrees, you're just struggling with one out of so many companies that I own. When will I recover my capital, Mr. Walaka? When will I recover my capital? Uh, but chief... We made 30.5 million naira this year. And this is our second year in the business. Just give me more time. Please, I will make it up, please. Just more time. Oh, God. You know what your problem is? Uh -uh. Do you know what your problem is? No, sir. It is called poverty mentality. Hey. Hey. Poverty mentality. Hey. You made just 30 million naira for a whole year. Yes. And you're here clapping for yourself. Listen to me. Next time you come here with such storyline, I will not only close that place down, I will make sure you end up in prison for fraud and embezzlement of my money. I am through with you. I said I'm through with you. I don't know, I'm just smiling. <laughs> You're just happy. Mm -hmm. Why? No, because of you, I guess. <laughs> so. <laughs> Baby. What? Will you marry me? Be serious. I'm sorry. I'm not prepared for this, please. Baby, why? Please don't do this to me. We've dated long enough. I mean, we are meant for each other. Please marry me, please. Sinto, I'm sorry. I can't do this. I have to go.
<laughs> yes, I will marry you. <laughs> oh, oh my God. <laughs> oh, why did you do this to me? Mm -hmm. So you Hello. think you're the only one that knows how to play pranks? No, this prank is, this one is too tough. This one is too tough, please. <laughs> Finally realizing yes I'm knowing it's true And no Smiling. one will ever do of me course. like you I don't think find somebody who could treat me like I'm you Cause I want you oh, oh, Baby can't you see I'm all yeah. about you Get down wow. on my knees so that, 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 that was a tough one you know? I can't walk, can't talk, mm -hmm. can't breathe I'm losing my cool Thank cause I'm so <laughs> Why did you do that? <laughs> Why? I'm sorry, but I have to do that. How can I, you know? I know. No, it's another person. Mm, what about Tontiamaka? She's a, such a nice person. I know, but it didn't work out between us. Hmm? Um, um, I really like her. I know you like her, but you're going to like this person that is coming. Hmm? Be fast and join me in the kitchen so we'll prepare a special meal. Hmm? Okay. Fast. Ngozi. Oh, quite young. Yeah. How are you? I'm fine. Okay. Ngo. Uh, You're welcome to my humble abode. I see. Not bad, not bad, not bad. Not bad, but um, the POP, it's not properly fixed. But it's fine. It's not uh, bad. Okay. Whoa, the blind. The table <laughs> and the seats. <laughs> well, <laughs> never mind. But in my father's house, the furnishing alone of the sitting room is worth over 20 million naira. Oh, for real? That's if I'm not underestimating it. For real? Uh, yes. Oh. <laughs> but not bad. I mean, it's not bad. Oh, it's okay. It's okay. We'll get it someday. We'll get it. Definitely. Definitely. <laughs> Have a seat. Thank you. We'll get it someday. <sighs> so, did you find it hard to look at your way to this place? No, no. I asked questions. I asked. But it's fine. I I'm all right. Okay. The most important thing is that I love you. <laughs> I love you too. Okay. Yeah. Um, did you get me something? Uh, I oh, 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 that's true. Okay. Sorry. Forgive my manners. Okay. Right back. Ew. <laughs> ah, I'm here. 
Uh, okay. Uh, I hope you like this. Um, fine. <laughs> oh, oh, no! No! Sorry, My sorry, goodness. so sorry, so sorry. Oh, let me get the No, don't worry, call, call the house get to get the tour. She's my sister, our last born. Oh, forgive my manners, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's okay. You know, I'm used to servants in my father's house, so most time it confuses me. I understand. <laughs> it's called a parent condition in psychology. You know, someone saying what you used to. Exactly. Okay. I'm glad you understand. Yeah, I do. I do. <laughs> Just call Ngo. her. Just call her now. Let's have it. Ngo. <sighs> Brother. Get me a towel. And be fast about it, please. Be fast. Oh, no. This place is messed up. Baby, how could you have done this? I mean, you know, it's the, it's the joy, you know. Be fast about it. Clean it and just leave us. Wipe it very well, please. Oh. We need to spoil this moment. Okay. It's okay. Just go. Just go. Okay, just leave you, us. Eh? Leave us. Go. She's my sister. Uh, fine. Just pour the drink. <laughs> okay. Ah. Uh. So, to our love. So that it may blow some. I love you, baby. I love you too. I love you more than you can ever imagine. I mean, most times I feel like I have known you over the years. Yeah, that's true. But well, this is true love. I know. Come on. <laughs> oh. Mm. <laughs> oh, this is good. Baby. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Come on, drink up. Yeah. Drink up. Mm. Nice. This is nice. You said you're going to eat my food someday. Here we are. Yes, I did. <laughs> so where is the food? Mm. Whoa. It looks nice. Yeah. Go, hold on. So you take this. Take the tree. Yeah. So who who made the food? God did. Then I assisted her. You? Yeah. You can cook? Of course. Right from my childhood. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. What of you? Well, I can cook. Mm -hmm. But with so many chefs and servants around, I have never been given the opportunity to showcase my talents. Mm. But do not worry, my darling. Once you're married, we'll employ a very good chef. And you know I cannot be cooking because I am going to be a minister. Minister? My dad said I'm going to be a minister of the Federal Republic. How? It's very simple. He'll just give them money and they'll make me a minister. Oh, oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. That would be great. Yes, it will. <clears throat> hey, uh, good. hey, when you want to serve people, you do it once. You don't serve bit by bit. Do you understand? Yes. Well, Hush. Hold on. <clears throat> Not bad. But next time, try and add ginger and garlic to your food. It's very healthy. And less salt, too. I'm not used to bad food. Alright? Can go. Hey, babe. That was too harsh. You know, the poor girl was expecting some commendation from you. I'm so sorry, darling. I do not commend people for wrong reasons. I corrected her so that she'll be better next time. Alright? It's okay. It's okay. okay. I'll hey, feed hey, you. Hey, 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 no, no. We have to pray before we eat. But I've already started. Oh, it's fine. Let's pray. You still have to pray. Okay? <sighs> Fine. So don't we? In Jesus' name. Amen. 
in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Father Lord, we will come your Holy Spirit, we will come you over this food. Come and take place, come and take control. As we eat, we get life into it. In Jesus' mighty name we pray. Amen. Oh baby, come on. It's not like I don't pray. We pray a lot in our house. Mm. My father is a knight of Semulumba. Wow. And my mother is the head of the Women's Guild, CWO. Wow. Myself, huh, I don't want to talk about me because you will be shocked. I'm from a Christian family. Wow. I pray a lot. In fact, baby, I can speak in tongues. Wow. <laughs> I'm very good, honestly. Wow. So don't worry yourself about prayers. When we get married, I am going to pray your ass out. <laughs> well, you, forgot, you don't forget to pray because of the wonderful food. Oh, not really that. I'm just <laughs> lost in love. <laughs> okay, let's Come on, eat up. Let's eat. Mm. 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 Hello? Hello? Ah, uh, it's CD now. I'm uh... Finally realizing, yes, I'm knowing it's true. Ain't no one ever do me like you. I know if you find somebody who could treat me like you, girl, I won't die. Ooh, oh, baby, can't you see I'm all about you? Get on my knees, sorry for waiting, I do. I can't walk, can't talk. Can't breathe, I'm losing my cool cause I'm missing you Big girl, I go die if you know they would me Not true, say No one can feel your space Big girl, I go by if you know stay with me Hey, whoa No one can feel your space Big girl, I go die if you know they with me Not true, say No one can feel your space Big girl, I go by if you know stay with me Hey, whoa No one can feel your space Affectionate oh girl, you best in my world, my personal babe. I want you to take your place. You are right that I need, you're the reason I exist. Oh, baby, wish I could bring back the days that you were mine. I won't bring back the days when we did time. If we bring back those days that we were one, spend the whole night. Make me try, girl. Hey girl I go die if you know they with me. Not true, say. No one can feel your space. Hey girl I go by if you know stay with me. Hey, whoa. No one can feel your space. Hey girl I go die if you know they with me. Not true, say. No one can feel your space. Hey girl I go by if you know stay with me. Hey, Mommy, please. I love this man. And he loves me too. I just want you to accept him because of me. I beg of you. Please. Sweetheart, I'm concerned about the class. The class? Yes. He's comfortable. Sweetheart, you need more than a comfortable man to take care of you. See, I've seen situations where these gold diggers come into families and pick what they want and leave. No, 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 no. mom. That's not true. My Somto is not a gold digger. He's doing well for himself. He's a young, promising man. Don't you understand? Mommy, please. I love him so much and he loves me too. That's what matters. Besides, were you not the one that told me that daddy didn't have as much money as he has now before he married you? Your daddy was from a royal family. Mommy, it doesn't count. What matters is that we love ourselves. Please, just... Do this for me. I beg you in the name of God. This guy loves me so much. He practically adores the very ground I walk on. What else do you want for your daughter? Please. Okay. Just just, just help me talk to daddy. I know you can always do that. You know how you do it. Please. Mm -hmm. well, I promise you I will. I'll talk to your father. I love you, mommy. <laughs> <laughs> but we know I know you will never fail me. Mm -hmm. Thank you. It's okay. I like it when it's small. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know how much I love this guy. That's why you're saying that. Mm -hmm. I can see it written on the wall. Oh, no, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, mommy. Thank you so I'll much. Touch you, so, I'll get you your favorite today. Mm -hmm. Yes, I'll go to. I know today you can give me an extra Chinese now, restaurant. I'll get you your food. Ah, honey! <laughs> right now. Okay, mommy, well, okay, I'm coming. Okay. okay. <laughs> Mm-hmm. 
Congratulations. Thank you. I'm so happy for you. <laughs> No, it's not easy to pass Mr. Kafo's course. Not even to talk of making an A. Wow. Thank That's you. <laughs> Thank you, Tina. Thank you so much. You know, I know how difficult that man is. So I was ready for him. I was really prepared. Of course, I was almost sleeping at the library just to make sure I passed this course. Oh, really? Yes. You know me now. <laughs> I don't have strength to donate anything to any lecturer just to pass his course. That was why I was really for, I was really ready for him. I was ready. I'm happy <laughs> for you, girl. I'm so happy. <laughs> Come on, Maka. What's the noise for? What is all this noise for? You made an A in Dr. Kafos' course. So what? Are you the first? Are you? Venda. Venda, what is wrong with you? I didn't call your name into this matter. I did not. What's the bragging all about? Ah, I have to sleep in the library. I don't have anything to donate. Who has something to donate? What are they donating? And to who? Venga. Amaka has not even said anything wrong here. Now she even referring to you. So why are you getting angry over nothing? Yes. Who is this one? Listen, you're not in our league. You don't know what's up. So just shift one side. Back one side. Idiot. Look at, look at, look at, look at. You passed Dr. Kapos. It's okay, please. Of course, you will not hear anything in this room. You have one American visa. Please, oh, let me Tenta, read my... Sorry, sorry for yourself. Sorry, no verse. Oh, today's lecture mm. was fantastic. That man, <laughs> that was like one of the best lecturers in this school. Tell me you there. I love you. Seriously. <laughs> hey, easy. <laughs> hey! Uju. Uju, you are not a nice person. You are not a nice person at all. So you heard this all along and you didn't tell me. Huh? <laughs> How the cookie crumbles. <laughs> oh my huh? goodness. So that arrogant idiot has been dropped like a rag. After all the gra gra. Huh? Hey, hey, I'm very happy. I am so happy. I am very happy. Stop it, Venza. <laughs> How can you be happy with another person's misfortune? Because I hate her guts. Hey? She thinks she's everything. But Somto has shown her that she is nothing. Nothing. Hmm. <laughs> hey, Venza. Well, Maka is a good girl. She troubles no one, but uh, I don't know the reason why you hate her like that. I hate people who are full of themselves. That Amaka girl is so arrogant and boastful. She thinks she's perfect. That's why I hate her. And I'm happy. <laughs> I am very happy that she has been dropped like a rat. At least she will mellow down or be humbled for once. Eh? Who does she think she is? The president's daughter. Hey. Hanging shoulders on the campus. I see if she, she's better than anybody. Ah. Well, I don't see her that way. If you like, see her that way. If you don't like, don't. But me, I am happy that Somto broke her heart. I am happy. I am very, very happy. Visa. Extremely happy. <laughs> you see me? You are impressing me. <laughs> I need, I need to drink. <laughs> I need some drink. Let's go to the dark side. Yeah, you're funny. <laughs> Good morning. Boy, I'm crazy about that girl. I can see. That is a good thing anyway, but um, it's the same thing you told me about on my account. Mm -mm -mm -mm. It's not the same thing. This girl I'm talking about is beautiful. She's loaded. Highly loaded front and back. And the father is a dawn. The father is loaded too. Something, something tells me that money is the main attraction here. Mm -mm -mm. Well, you won't blame me. Who doesn't want to go to the next level? 
Wouldn't you want to change your car? Or build your own, your own house? Wouldn't you want that? Huh? Well, <laughs> Man, with this kind of a law, your life will automatically change. But Amaka's father, um, he's a big boy too. Yeah, yeah. Well, he is, but you know, Amaka's father is so stingy. That man is very stingy. I mean, he speaks a lot of grammar. Oh boy, in English we go chop. <laughs> eh? <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> but on a very serious note, this is the point where you have to make a choice. Mm -hmm. Seriously. Is it money you want or a peaceful marriage? Oh boy, both. Both of them. I've worked so hard for myself that I deserve the best in life. Mm -hmm. I deserve the best in life. The two best things in this world, money and love. Who wouldn't want it? Hmm? Well, um... Anyway, I'm seeing the big man next week. Wow. <laughs> so you guys are this serious? Very serious. Very, very serious we are. Imagine. Okay, let's look at it this way. Imagine if I marry Oledo and the father deposit 500 million naira to our bank. Automatically, my status will change. I'll become a big boy. Yes. <laughs> you're making sense, bro. <laughs> and gradually, you're making me start thinking of reviewing my choice. How? Reviewing my choice, of course. Step into the next level, too. My hand, no deal. Anita will kill somebody. <laughs> My hands are clean. <laughs> You're behind me, right? You don't know. I don't understand. We've broken up. Eh? I mean, I and Anita. We are no longer together. Stepping up. All right, babe. Come on. I'm ready. Let's go. Baby, what is this you're wearing? Are you going to the office? Or you're coming to see my parents? What is wrong with my dressing? Everything is wrong with it. You have to dress expensive. You dress as if you're going to the office and it's not nice. It's so formal. You want my father to think that it's one ordinary guy that's coming to ask for his favorite daughter's hand in marriage. Is that what you want him to think? Baby, but this is not looking bad. No, 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 this no. is fine. Everything is wrong with this outfit. It's not looking nice at all and you have to change it. Baby, this is a very important moment. First impression matters. And my family takes seriously to stuff like this. Please. Okay, if you insist, I will go up and change into something good. I insist. Hmm? And you have to dress very classy. Uh -huh. Like a smart senator and a designer's shoe or good sandals could do. Uh, That's what you're wearing. Babe, those dresses are for special occasions. Excuse me, babes. What occasion could be more special than coming to see my people? Baby, please now, don't do uh, this. It's, it's okay. Don't spoil it's today okay. for me. In, in fact, I am coming with you to choose for you. Let's go. You win. It's not a matter of me winning. It's a matter of I coming with you because I'm going to choose for you what you're going to win. Okay, let's go. Come on. Uh, what do you want to do? You want to dress like this and come and see my father? Do you know what I'm coming to see my father? Let's go. Come on. Oh, <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. 
Thank you, ma. I must say you look good. Oh. You look good too, ma. <laughs> um, my husband will soon be with you. Okay. Okay. Thank you. Natural. Thank you, ma. Oh, my I have visitors right now. You know how it is, people are always coming. That is it, my brother. People are coming to take. Nobody's adding to your success. <laughs> they are coming to collect, to reduce, to minus, and if possible, to steal from you. <laughs> hey, exactly. Criminals and gold diggers all over the place. <laughs> That can be very funny. He doesn't mean any harm. What? You didn't lock him up? That serves him right. <laughs> Listen, Owa, any idiot that tries any nonsense around us must go to prison. They don't know what we went through to make it, but they want to share the money. And not sharing in the suffering. Nonsense. Oh well, let me attend to my visitor. We will conclude this matter at the club later. Oh why in the Oh we believe Oh one dear mono. You're coming. Daddy, funny that. Sit down. Dad, he's the young man I told you about. His name is Tom Tochuku. You're welcome. Thank you, sir. I heard you are from Omoabo. Yes, yes, sir. I like Omoabo people. They are not thieves like their neighbors. <laughs> no, we are not. Who is your father in Omoabo? My father was Engineer Vitalis Ibekwe. He was a senior lecturer in the State University. But he's late now. My daughter says you're a banker, operations manager. Yes, I am. You guys are bankers, but with nothing to show. Always begging me for money. They bank other people's money, but there's nothing in their account. Are you one of them? Uh, no, sir. No. I hope so. Because I want my daughter to be happy. She's my last child, and she's very dear to me. Many people have come for her, but she rejected them. The last man that came, she said, he is short. But I said, as long as the man's money is tall, the man is tall. <laughs> but she said no, that she wants a tall man just like you. Thank you, sir. You see, I allow my children to make their choices in life. 
as long as they are not paupers or gold diggers. My first daughter is married to Chief Udeze's son. You know Chief Udeze? Uh, Chief Udeze. You mean you don't know Okemiri okay, Nebogwe of Umasato? Oh, Okemiri? Okay, oh, yes, I know him. I know him. <laughs> My son is studying law in London. You know he needs to be strong since he's going to inherit everything. He needs to be strong to fight enemies and criminals that will come for my money. Mm. Akarugo Wan, Ezioku, Governor's Office. Thank you for the information. I am coming over immediately. <laughs> um, my friend. I have to run now, but we will meet again to talk man to man. Okay, sir. Meanwhile, we have accepted you. Oh, thank you, Daddy. <laughs> thank you. My daughter. Daddy. Take care of him. Make sure he gets everything he wants. Sure, okay? I will. Thank you. Okay, I have to run now. <laughs> thank you. Bye. <laughs> <laughs> Lala, thank you. You're welcome. Thank you very much. You don't want to eat anything. Well, you have to eat something. No, I'm... I'm Why not I'm, take something I'm, light? Yes. Okay, we have quite a lot in the dining table. Yes, I'm going to make so many things, so you have to eat. Okay. Please. I'm going to leave you a prepare. <laughs> What did I ever do to you? <laughs> do I deserve this humiliation? Do I? So do I? Why me? Why me? So do I me? Why me? Why me? So do I me? <laughs> Amaka, why sitting here all alone? Don't tell me you're still thinking about this guy. Tina, what did I do to Tamto? After exposing me to the world, he decided to humiliate me this way. Why? Why me? Look, why, Tina? Why? It's okay. Look, let me tell you something. Any guy that disappoints you like this is not your guy. It's not meant for you. You know, God might just be saving you from this. Mom said that. I'm talking from experience. The guy that disappointed me three years ago. I almost died. But where is he now? Where is he? In prison in Malaysia. Life sentence. How come you never told me about that? Life experiences are for us to learn from it. And not to dwell in it. I can't keep living in my past. So you should thank God that it happened now you haven't entered. Or would you want to be like Deborah? Who is Deborah? Deborah that married in her first year. After the big society wedding, the marriage crashed under one year. Oh, that's true. That was so sad. So stop thinking about him, okay? He did himself, not you. Your grief is just for the moment. But his will be prolonged. You will see it happen, okay? Let's go. Well, promise me this won't happen again. I promise. I would delete everything about Sumto from my heart and move on. That I promise. That's my friend. So get your bag, let's go. Sure.
Lolo, I agree with you. Thank you. Thank you, Lolo. Um, excuse me. Um, Lolo, I saw this in a shop and I thought you would like it. Hey, you got something for my mom? Yeah. Thank you. You got this for me? Yes, ma'am. Beautiful. <laughs> All this for me? Yeah. Beautiful. I hope you like it. This is beautiful. Where did you get this? Uh, from Ojigo de Mogo. That means it will be very expensive then. Yeah. Do you still have money on you? <laughs> you know how you see that shop? Yeah. Thank you, baby. Ojigo de Mogo. Thank, Thank you. you. <laughs> Thank you, my dear. Thank you, Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you knew my mother is a woman of class. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Good evening, sir. Thank you. Good day, Dad. Good day, sir. Thank you, sir. I was told that you wanted to see me. Oh, yes, sir. Oh, excuse me. So I want to inform you that I'll be coming with my people for the introduction, Ikwaka. So please, I need your approval. You want to come for formal introduction? Yes, sir. You're prepared? Very prepared, sir. What date do you want to propose? First week of next month. Fourth, precisely. I'll keep that date open to receive you and your people. Oh. Thank you very much, sir. Thank you, Daddy. I'm so happy. But first of all, you have to come. Let me anoint you for the task ahead. Oh. Nail down. Sorry, sir. Excuse me. You really want to get married? Yes, sir. And it's my daughter you want to marry? Exactly. Exactly. Hey! 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 Don't you want to get married? Yes, yes, I want to. Nail down. Yeah? You want to get married, don't you? Yes, yes, I want to get married, yes. Nail down. Hey! Mm. So you really want to marry? Uh, yes, sir. Daddy, mm. oh. not so fair. Okay. Sit down. Uh. Now tell me, sorry. I sorry. said, tell me, sorry. Sorry, sir. I didn't hear you. Sorry, sir. Good. Since your father is late, I want to be both your father and your in-law. I just taught you one hard lesson in getting married. That was the same lesson my father taught me when I was ready to get married. What just happened here now is the best way and the only way your marriage can be successful. Your wife will continue to offend you again and again but you really want to say sorry sweetheart is it true or false I don't know. <laughs> young man sir if you're not ready to obey this golden rule then get up and leave my house now I'm not going anywhere. I'm ready to obey the golden rule. Good. Now you're talking. You can come with your people on the said date. Thank you. You're welcome. Wait. Your dad, wow. Your dad is just an interesting personality. <laughs> Don't eh? mind my father. He's always coming up with surprises. I can see such a surprise. He had knock on my head. <laughs> I'm so sorry, my darling, but he's not harmful. He's very considerate. 
you're going to like him, okay? I already say that. It's okay. I got to go now. Okay, babe. Hmm? Mm. 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 Take care. Okay. I'll Take talk care. to you. Love you. Love you too. Bye. I need you to help me. I need okay. 500k from you. I'll give you by the end of the month. Please. For what? An investment? Uh, no, not for an investment. It, it, this might sound unusual, but it's very real. Okay? okay. The introduction is going to cost me 2.5 million naira. What? Introduction? Yes. Ha. I thought it was just all about. Carrying one or two relatives and then buying a gift for the girl and probably a few cartons of drinks. Yes, but the question is what kind of drink are we buying and the kind of gift for the girl? What if the gift is that's the video and drama kind of gift? Porsche car, you know? Boss, yeah. you have to learn to cut your coat according to your size. That's exactly what I am doing him. Only they even told me that the sister's husband spent over five million for the introduction. She's even worried had own is appearing cheaper. Five million. I mean, did the young man buy the girl an aeroplane? No, but she bought a set of jewelry worth one point five million for the girl, another one point two million for the mother. Not to talk of the father and the, and, 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 and his friends. I mean, if just common introduction is like this, I wonder how the main wedding <sighs> look like. Bros, are you sure you can handle this? Why not? Why not I can? I have a target here. You use money to get money. This man has only one son. I understand oh, yeah. he's going to share his wealth among his children. I mean, there are three children of this man. Do the mass. No, do the mass. Bros, please. Please, I am going to pay you back this money. Please give me this 500k, please. You will never regret it. Please. Well, it's okay, I will give you the money. God, thank you. Because you are my friend. Thank you, thank you, thank you so much. But please, please and please. You will give me back my money by the end of the month. I will. You have no problem about that. I will, trust me. I am going to pay you back. I will be fine and you will be fine. Please. Men, come on, cheers. 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 Come on, cheers first, please. <laughs> you, made me, you made me feel good now. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh, I'm good. Sitting here. Um, brother, the money. Which money? My school fees. I told you to give me a little time. I have a project at hand. But you are threatening to send those who have not paid their school fees home. I will come and tell your principal to give me a little time. Okay? But what about the nice one? He called to ask you about his own money. Same thing applies. You guys should give me a little time. Okay? Please, I'm late to work, okay? Where is my... Oh! <laughs> oh, Jubei! 
things of me. You look sweet, baby. Thank you. I always do. <laughs> baby girl, have you heard the latest? <laughs> The fate of our friend Amaka has been sealed. Mm -hmm. <laughs> that guy, Sumto, has done introduction on another lady's head. Are you serious? Yes. In oh fact, <laughs> let me laugh in French. Chinka, chinka, chinka. Oh, I'm so happy. I am so, so happy. You know, on that wedding day, I'm going to sew a nice dress and attend the wedding, at least to spite Amaka. Mm. What is wrong with you, Venza? Eh? Why are you always attacking Amaka? She attacks me too. Were well, you not there the day she called me Obanje? Hmm? I will show her how Obanje girl behaves. Yes, me, Venza, she, Obanje. She just spoke out of anger that day because you were attacking her. Then I will angrily deal with her. Yes, what is that? Who is she? <gasps> oh my oh. god. <laughs> Please yourself. Oh. Hey, I've saved my own. One man is waiting for you at the hostel. He said he's been calling you, but you're not picking. Who? <gasps> it's Frank. Oh. My phone has been on silent. Please, I have to rush to the hostel before all those hustlers snatch him from me. I'm coming. Please. All right, I'll see you later. Okay. <laughs> your car I don't have a car you don't have a car what about the Jeep I saw you with the first day well that's that wasn't mine it I actually borrowed it really yeah but we can do taxi excuse you I don't do taxi in my house. Even as a little kid, I was taken to school with big cars like Range Rover Sports, Mercedes Benz. What to talk of now? Please. There are cars littered all over my father's compound. I didn't come with any to the campus because he wanted me to concentrate in my studies. How do you expect me to enter a taxi? You see what I'm wearing? Look at my Gucci shoe. My friend, excuse me, can't do that. Please. Well, I am sorry. But please, let us manage it for now. Manage? Like I'm supposed to walk out before I get a taxi on my high heel? Please. Okay, please. Oh, you're just suffering me for nothing. How do you expect me to walk? That distance on this high heel. You suffering me. I don't like it. Okay, baby. Should I carry you? Like that. Okay, okay, fine. I'll manage. Let's go. Sorry. You just have to go ahead of me and get the taxi inside, please. Alright then. Beauty is so real. Talk of the way you talk so real. I know for to live without your smile. You're my world. Oh. Now ever since she gave this love to me. Baby girl keeping me in luxury uh -huh. Like a part of me I don't wanna leave wanna Even if she calls or she orders me okay. I kinda keep my mind disorderly Man I don't know but I'm kinda loving it uh -huh. You smile and I'm like God Please uh -huh. baby girl how you really God. got me? It's for sure you're my angel Sent from heaven gave me a concept I had my success so true Cool when you come with your smile She make me to feel like oh, 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 oh. My baby inside you Oh, 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 oh,
Smile, God's fire to cut my eyes, and I swear, say I like you. Baby, my desire, your smile sets me on fire. Got me going higher, ain't that kind of light? Your beauty is so real. Talk of the way you talk so real. I know if I can live without your smile, you're my world. Catwalk, you know I love that. The way you put a smile up, you know I love that. I'm gonna do all I gotta do to keep you smiling. Watching that put a face is so charming. Uh -huh. Put it lately, you be gone me with your left touch. Ooh, I feel like fly. You make me feel high, you set my soul on fire. You put me on the move like a love rider. With you, I ain't got no wahala. With you, I feel like oh, oh. With you, I ain't never gonna have a fallback. <laughs> When you make that move, I'm so confused. When you make that move, you told me yo. You got me trapped, trapped in your beauty. I'm so high. Oh, 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 You turn my world around the girl, this ride on I like the way you want it so slow I'm gonna hold you so tight and never let you go Girl, you killing me slowly I like what you do with your body The thing that you me likes, I wanna hold it Roll it, girl, just do it You're my reggae beat, so You're my reggae beat, so You're my reggae beat, so You're my reggae pizza And you change my world with your beats Her body is so tight She think like Jamaica, no When she walk on that body She makes you wanna hold her home She say she's wa maka na ma wa ka ne i ma ka ho Girl, I go die yo, so make you try yo to take a meal slow. I won't go low. You're my reggae beat, so. You're my reggae beat, so. You're my reggae beat, so. The way you move, they make me go. You're my reggae beat, so. You're my reggae beat, so. You're my reggae beat, so. My son, sir, before we proceed to the next level of marriage proposal, I want us to have man-to-man -man talk. Okay, sir. Like I said before, many suitors have come for my daughter's hand, but she rejected them all. I brought Chief Idoko's son. She complained that 
he is a drug addict. Oh. That one I agree with her. But what about Chief Awandiana's son? What is wrong with him? I don't know. Anyway, my daughter said it is you that she wants. I have no problem with that. I accept that. Thank you, sir. From what I witnessed during the introduction ceremony, there's a serious problem that needs to be addressed. Okay. Yes. From my observation, it is obvious that you are struggling with your finances. My daughter cannot marry a man who is struggling. For what? Didn't I suffer enough for them? Anyway, how do you want me to help you as your father-in-law? That's why I invited you. Uh, okay, sir. I thank you for you. Ha, Barista Madoka. What is the problem? Huh? Are you saying that those idiots entered my property? What have you done? No, that is not good enough. Let me call the commission of police. Why? In that case, make sure that they are locked up in the cell until Monday. If any of them sleeps in their house this weekend, I will hold you responsible. Nonsense. I will show them what fire does with the ear of a rat. Let me get back to my visitor. Uh huh. Now tell me, how can I help your financial situation so you'll be able to take care of my daughter? Okay, sir. Sir, thank you very much for the privilege. Sir, let's say I want you to make a fixed deposit in our bank. Let's say 300 million or more. That will enable me gain quick promotion to, to, to the position of a manager or even area manager. <laughs> that is poor man's thing. I should give you my money to go and dump in your bank. My son, Sir. if you want to be a millionaire, you must think like a millionaire. You have to resign your job at the bank. Resign? Yes. I have a company that I invested so much money, but I am not getting good result. The man that is running it now doesn't have business acumen. He thinks it's all about speaking grammar. I want you to take over that company as the MD. You will fix your own salary and allowances. Are you interested? Uh, yes, yes, sir. Sure. With your contact and experience as a banker, you can easily source funds to facilitate the growth of the company. If you do well, I will give you 40% shares of the company. That automatically makes you a multimillionaire. Then you quit the slavery at the bank and have time to take care of my daughter. What do you say? Uh, thank you, sir. I, I'm happy. No, thank Oledo. She's the only one I can do this for. Okay, sir. But, sir, when do I start? <laughs> Since yesterday. Uh, okay, sir. Please, can I take like one month to at least clear up my table? That is the difference between rich people and poor people. Poor people like to take their time to think, analyze, speculate, while the rich man acts and gets results. Uh, um, sir, what if, uh, let me just take like one week to do that. It's up to you. Time is money. Work today. 
No, I am not working with the bank anymore. Why? I've resigned. Resigned? Yeah. So? Go see. I have gotten a better job in a big company. Yes. Ngo, this job is going to take care of our financial needs effortlessly. And I'll be able to have time for myself as the managing director of the company. Oh, thank God. And two, you and Ekene can equally come and work there when you have holiday and make more money for yourselves. Yay, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. <laughs> Uh, you cannot go to school, huh? Okay. And don't bother about me, okay? Okay. Yeah. Bye-bye. Yeah, take care of yourself, huh? Okay. Mm. Yeah, who is that? I'm good. So how are you enjoying your new office? <laughs> I love it. I love it so much. This is just my dream job. <laughs> I knew daddy would do it. I mean, there's practically nothing that he wouldn't do for me. Thank you so much, my love. <laughs> it's alright. But right. just uh, some little challenges, you know, for a start. Challenges? What challenges are you talking about? Uh, you know, the general manager, you mm. know, he's kind of Slow. I wish he can be faster so we will meet up our target. That man? I mean, that man again? I told daddy to sack him. But he kept saying that he has relationship with his brother and it's going to stop. What are you doing? Don't need to worry about that. Hello? Is that Miss Owalaka? I want to see you at the MD's office immediately. Uh, it doesn't matter. Don't worry yourself. Why did you summon him for? When he comes, you'll find out. Good morning, sir. You sent for me. Mr. Walaka. Will you get up from there? Is something wrong with you? Mr. Walaka. I understand that you're still as lazy as ever. Right? What do you think this place is? A relaxation spot? The demotion that was given to you previously was not enough for you, right? Uh, sorry, madam. I don't understand. Will you shut that thing you call a mouth? Is something wrong with you? How do you talk while I'm talking? This is how you people go about running other people's businesses down because you do not know how to suffer to make their money. I mean, what is all this? Now listen. Listen now. Listen very attentively. You have to sit up. Otherwise, be ready to look for another job. Don't leave my presence. MD, why did you invite me? Look at this man. Have you lost your sanity? I said, out of here! I said, get out! Nonsense. Babe, babe, what's all that for? My love, you do not know all those people. If you don't put your foot down, they're going to climb on your head. That is how they go about ruining other people's businesses. I mean, I will not have that in my father's company. I won't have that. And I won't have anyone ma ma make things difficult for you. I won't. For Christ's sake, I am in charge here. You made me look as if I'm reporting my subordinate. As if I'm not capable of handling situations. Babes, I, I was only trying to help. By, by embarrassing me and the manager? Come on, this kind of attitude can dampen the spirit of the staff. Eh, hey. hey, so I have done something wrong now. I am not the bad person. Because I'm trying to protect my husband, Daddy. I'm not the bad person. It's alright, it's fine. But mind you that whenever anything happens in this company, I will not intervene. I will not. Have to, you just have to take it easy, okay? Okay? Sweetheart. 
this. Come on. You're not doing badly. Thank you, sir. At least not like that stubborn Owalaka. Thank you, sir. But you need to step up. I need you to quickly take out loan and procure more machinery from abroad. Sir, there are some outstanding loans we are still servicing. And it's eating into our income. Stop servicing those loans. But sir, if we stop, the bank will get agitated. You're talking like a banker. While I'm talking like an investor. My instruction to you is to stop servicing those loans and apply for more loans. With, with which collateral, sir? Use the same collateral for the new loan. Oh, no, sir. It's unethical. Fool. It's bank money, your father's money. That is why people like you remain poor. You think making money is about morality and ethics? And wearing suit and speaking big grammar? No, sir. But you know, as a banker, I know that... My friend, follow my instructions and make sure you follow it all the way through. Or you resign and I hire someone that has the labor to make money. I am through with you. Thank you, sir. Leave that file for me. I'll take a closer look at, at it later. Okay, sir. Thank you. Sorry to disturb you, but I'm here again. Not because girl, I don't feel it without your love. You're the one that I built my world around. I know it looks somehow, but I see they beg, make you try understand. Cause I've given everything, I've given all my life. You're the one, only one in my heart. This is true, you set me high. When I see you, I'm on fire. I don't feel to sleep, you cut in my brain. You're my only one desire Yes, it's true, you set me high When I see you, I'm on fire I know fit to sleep, you've got to my brain You're my only one desire I go out of a coma if ever you love someone And I got no be me I go out of a coma if ever you love someone And I got no be me I go out of a coma, oh From the girl I fit at you I go and talk for coma, oh, from the girl I fit at you. Oh. Baby, tell me what it takes. Waiting I do just to get to you. I don't think I'm well and I know if you understand. Tell me what it takes, I will do it if I can. See, I don't find, I don't try, I don't cry, I won't ask. I say, I don't find, I don't try, I don't cry, I won't ask. Baby, see, you be the one where they make me breathe, make me breathe, make me breathe. And you be the one where they make me feel. Make me feel, make me feel. See, girl, I know how you, but girl, I won't die you. I go and talk for coma if ever you love someone, and that guy no be me. I go and talk for coma if ever you love someone, and that guy no be me. I go and talk for coma, oh, from the girl I fit to you. I go and talk for coma, oh. From the girl I fit at you, girl I fit at you. Oh. Yes, it's true you set me high. When I see you, I'm on fire. I don't fit to sleep. You got to my brain. You're my only one desire. Yes, it's true you set me high. When I see you, I'm on fire. I don't fit to sleep. You got to my brain. 
You're my only one desire I go out of a coma if ever you love someone And I got no be me I go out of a coma if ever you love someone And I got no be me I go out of a coma From the girl I feel tired I go out of a coma From the girl I feel tired I go out of a coma if ever you love someone and I got no be me. I go and I fuck on my if ever you love someone. And I got no be me. I go and I fuck on my own. I fuck on my own. I'm the girl I fit at you. I go and I fuck on my own. From the girl I fit at you. We started like it will never end Every place where we go there's ain't no time And this was our dream So we must stay real Say we never fall yes, yes we going up And there was no one there to help us out Say you get silent Not for your mind We tried that we could We hustled all time Dreaming one day there'll be a sunny day As we kept on trying and we believe God was with us As we kept on pushing on Just waiting for God to help us The one night God changed our mom And she paid for almost all All the say we saw some of our things But now I'm sure God really cares And that's true You've always been So far, with you on our side, we they go high. You've always been there when there's no one else. So we they thank you for all so far, with you on our side, we they go high. It was one, then become two. Doing things and running things cause we won't group Take it to the streets, call them CD Hoping say one day we go they run the city Big bro you go ever still the look out for me Get me to believe whenever I'm losing my feet Yeah it could be hard, we go pull through Just gotta believe and we do what we do Always there for me See please Would you care for me? Ma please Keep the beats coming Goons, please, ah, uh, please <sighs> You know we spend time to keep it real Make sounds to show just the way we feel Took us a while coming But made it true Cities and stores and it's just Man, it's not been easy at all At all You know the pressure is too high in me But I'm coping they say good things don't come easy. Of course, yes. You know, where there is a will, there's always a way. <laughs> sure, sure. You know, this job is cool. At least it's giving me more time to myself. And of course, more money. <laughs> <laughs> you're right, you're right. But these big men, they are funny. They are not easy at all. You know, sometimes it looks as if you're free to do everything you want to do, but on the other way around, they have their own way of pulling the strings and controlling things for themselves, especially phones. <laughs> you know? Well, that is why they are big men. Exactly. You're right. <laughs> but you know, um, I'm working so hard to ensure he fulfills his promise of the 40% shareholding of the company. Wow. Bro, seriously. That is huge. Yeah, very huge. Big. Very big. <laughs> you know, according to Chief, he said it will make me automatic multi-millionaire. You know, it will make you automatic multi-millionaire. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, <laughs> well, 
let's toast to future automatic multi millionaire you can say that again <laughs> The last time I asked you to wait for me, you defied me and went to your house. Because according to you, it was getting too late. What's the meaning of that? I, so this house is not big enough for you to sleep? And this is big enough, but I didn't plan it, sir. So I... What is lacking here? Food? Room? Servants? You seem to have a lot of pride. Poor man shouldn't have pride. Is that clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Today again, for the second time, you left when I asked you to wait. Sir, I had urgent things to attend at the office. What can be more urgent than my call? Sir, the supplies of... Uh, uh... Shut up, my friend. Is it not my company? Sir, I wouldn't want us to incur the loss. Is it not my loss? Am I no longer the CEO? Yeah. You have started challenging me when you are yet to marry my daughter. So when you marry my daughter, you will chase me out of here. No, God forbid, sir. That will never happen. So I am a liar. No. Oh, I'm lying. No, you're not, sir. You're not. Chief, you're not. You're not lying. Please. It's quite obvious you are yet to understand the dynamics of this level of business. Let today be the last time I will summon you and you have risen to live without my consent. I'm sorry, sir. So sorry. Please forgive me. Leave. It's okay. Um, have a nice day, sir. Yes, hello, Frank. Hi, love. How are you? No, I'm not okay. What is it? My father traveled to London since last week and I can't reach him on the phone. I need to register something in school and honestly, I don't know what to do. Look, it's okay, please. Just take it easy, okay? Listen, if I don't complete the registration, I'm going to lose a whole semester. It's not funny. All right, so how much are we talking about here? Just 50K. 50,000. Okay, look, I don't have such amount of money now, but I'm very certain it will be available by weekend. Is that okay by you? Okay, I'll wait. Thank you. It's all right, my dear. You know I can't allow you to suffer. That's nice. It's all right, so where will you be by weekend? Oh, at our, li <clears throat> at our house in VGC. Oh, okay, it's all right. Please do take care of yourself, okay? Mm. Yeah. <laughs> Love you too. Wow. <laughs> Stingy man. Couldn't even do transfer for me.
trunk. Hello, love. Where are you? Okay, I'm in Banana Island. Yes, um, I'm in my auntie's place. He's uh, her birthday is tomorrow, holding at uh, Shireton. So I'm here helping her out, get ready for the birthday tomorrow. All right, nice. I would have actually loved to see you. Oh, I'm, I'm very busy right now. So anything? Yes, I wanted to give you the money you requested. Oh, the money! Oh, sweetheart, you can make a transfer. It's it's easier and quicker. Look, baby, I have cash now. And I don't have any money on my online account. Alright, if you say so, just tell me where you are. I'll come to you. Where are you? I... I'm right in front of your house. <laughs> in front of my house? I said I'm in Banana Island. Are you in Banana Island? Right in front of your house. <laughs> How do you mean? So this is the VGC and Banana Island you've been talking about. Well, I knew you've been lying to me all this while, but I just decided to give you a benefit of doubt. And yes, I have a car. In fact, cars. <laughs> I just decided to give you a little test. And you failed. You didn't just fail. You failed woefully. Frank, Frank, please, I'm sorry. It's it, 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 the, the devil's work. I, I'm sorry. Please, I, I'm sorry. Please forgive me. I'm sorry. I, I won't do it again, please. Frank. Try to be real, baby. Always. It doesn't pay to live a fake life. Hmm? Bye. Frank, I love you. Frank, I love you. Frank, I love you. I love you. I'm sorry. I love you with my heart. I said I'm sorry. It will not happen again. Please. Can you just don't please, obstruct Frank. me again? Frank, 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 please. Frank. Hey. Hey. How, how did he find me here? How, how did he? Hey. Oh. Guy, you know, I just confirmed what my mother used to tell me some years ago. Mm -hmm. She said, if you see a young, beautiful girl who is of a marriageable age and is not yet married, neither does she have a ring in her finger to prove that she's been engaged to be married, one thing must be a major problem. Why? That what? is her character. Why, why do you say that? Each time I think of this, eh, I just feel like a fool. You know, <laughs> there's this girl I have been following for the past few months. Mm -hmm. Beautiful. Very pretty. Black. Tall. Bros, if you see this girl's waist. Mm -hmm. eh? mm -hmm. <laughs> In fact, she was just my ideal woman. Mm. Can you imagine? She used to tell me... Anyway, she claimed that uh, her father lived in Banana Island. Mm. Really? Then her siblings or relatives live in VGC. She told me that her father shuttles overboard like Ojo Alegba. But guess what? Yesterday, I discovered her true and real habitat. Where? Bros, this girl lives in a ghetto. Wagam. Not just any kind of ghetto. Face me, I face you. I saw her with my two eyes. Face? Drying clothes, not on the rope. The queen, she, she, she was drying clothes on the fence. Uh. <laughs> oh my god. Face me, face you. For you? Do you know the most annoying part? The most annoying part is that ever since I met this girl, I have been spending. Uh. If you take her to an eatery to eat, mm. she will eat so much. Mm. Not just so much. After eating, she would demand for takeaway. Like two, three takeaway. If it was one, I'll say, okay, two. Gluto. 
Don't even make mistakes. Say, okay, let's go for shopping. You know, normally, like you do your girlfriend, let's go for shopping, bros. I go. Anything her eye sees, <whistles> you pay. Anything her eye sees, she will carry. But, but that was what got me suspicious. So I decided to start monitoring her. Trust a guy now. Uh, uh, but, but, but. I monitored her until I found out where she lived. And I discovered that she lived in a face, may I face you? And then her mother says, Pepe. Ah! Pepe. I'm not talking about boutique. Pepe. In front of the house. So to tell you how much your guy has suffered. <laughs> okay. Okay. What was her reaction when you bust her? When you saw her, what was her reaction? That reaction? Yeah. <laughs> Let me even shock you. When I saw the house and then I saw her, I drove away from the house a little bit. Then I called her on phone. I told her that I would like us to see. Do you know what she told me? I'm not around. <laughs> uh, I went to see my auntie in in Banana Island. I'll become if you see lie. Be this be with... one is not the lie you hear, it's the one you see. <laughs> <laughs> and then I stepped, trust me, I stepped out of the car and told her, she now asked me, where are you? I told her that I'm in front of your house. That was when hair let loose. Before she turned, she saw me behind her. Hi, <laughs> red-handed. And then she now brought the, I can imagine. She, she, she now told me, it was the devil. Hi. The devil don't suffer. I'm telling you. This devil don't suffer. That's in serious suffer. Would this this devil this devil don't suffer my And life. I'm sure the devil was not even close to a house then. He was just crawling somewhere. <laughs> like he do he normally does now. Around, moving around. Anyway, my guy, just take heart, you know. That's how all these guys behave. You know, just just chill. Don't take it too serious. You understand? I, <laughs> I don't say you don't chop your money where well, but don't 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 feel too bad, okay? <laughs> Sir, my company has a new product that covers every risk, not just fire and flood. So, Mr. Teller, I've told you that this company is fully covered by a reputable insurance firm. I know, sir. But there is always something for everyone. So at least give us part of the business. It's not good for just one company to cover all risk. Okay, sir. It was just look at this, you know, just take a look at it, this can, this is the new product we have now. Mm. Yeah, even this. Hey, baby. Hi. Hey. How are you? I'm alright. Mm. you doing? Are you a staff of this company? No. no. Then what are you doing here? Uh, I am... I'm, I'm, I'm honey. Oh, she's an insurance marketer. She's here to converse for her company. Converse for what? What are you talking about? Madam, I know what you want to do. You are not here to market any stupid insurance. You are here to market yourself. Excuse me. Your stupid self, I said. I take exception to that. Oh, will you shut up? And now, I need you to get out of this office. I need to speak to my husband in private. You don't need to talk to me in that manner. Shut up your mouth! Hey. Are you mad? It's not It's not your mouth! Shut up! 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 Shut You actually escorted her after she wanted to fight me. You should have followed her to her house. Or maybe spend the night there. What is wrong with you? What do you mean what is wrong with me? Only the water's come over you. Do you have to embarrass the poor lady that way? Oh, what? please, please, don't even tell me that. Soto, father did not have this company over to you for you to use it and humiliate me. Meaning what? Do you know that I did not like what just happened? 
Why? How could you be in a uncompromising room with that lady? You be here all by yourself. Why? What are you insinuating? Am I not supposed to entertain visitors anymore? It is not in your position. She could leave the, leave the gate men, the clerks. They are the people that could attend to her, but not you, the MD. Oh, Lady, I am the only one who. Oh, I... please! Do not upset me now. I mean, what is all this? Do you think I'm a child? <sighs> please. Today will be the very last day I will, I will entertain such riffraff in this, in this office. I will not have it again. Never! No, no one messes with me. No one. Um, sorry, excuse me. Um, can I have your attention for a minute? My name is Dan. Sorry, I'm in a hurry. Um, sorry, can I get your number? I can give you a call later. Zero zero okay. three five four okay. nine eight okay. seven zero five. I must say that you are so beautiful. I'll call you. I gave you wrong number. Wait, wait! It's the wrong number, wait! Wait, it's the wrong number, wait! It's the wrong number! Wait! 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 It's the wrong number! Hey, okay, okay! Okay, help me! Hey, hey! Hey, hey, hey! I gave you wrong number, oh! I gave you wrong number! I gave... Hey! Hey, oh, well, well! Who is pushing me from my village, you? Oh? That's fine, Benza! Greatest Benza! I would have caught a big fish now. Hey! Bender, what is wrong with you? Are you so somebody is not chasing me from my village? Look at fine man with fine car just gave me the wrong number. Hey! Hey! Hey, hey! 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 Rubbish. Hey! Look at big meat. Hey? Fine Venza. Newest model. Hey! Is he coming back? Hi, Benda. Hi. What's up? Hi. Are you okay? I'm fine. But you look worried. I'm just wondering. I said I'm fine. Fine, it's okay. Thank you. Benda, baby. <laughs> If I take this thing out of my sight, do I look like your church member? Or did I complain to you that I asked me to help? Get out! No. Get out! Please! Idiot. Fool. This girl is a witch. Amaka is a witch. Yes, 
Okay. It's time to sing to the birthday girl. One, two, go! Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, happy birthday. Happy birthday to you. How old are you now? 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 I'm close one today. Party tonight at Rainbow Square Garden. Yay! <laughs> oh, hope we are ready. Uh, we are born ready. We are ready. Now it's time for fastest finger. Oh! Everyone is ready. I'm ready. I'm wow. Here it is. Mm -hmm. One thousand naira crazy. Here we go. Six, seven, zero, five, six, nine, nine, three, five, four, four, five, five, three, five, four, eight. Yes, I have the card. Oh my God! Used by who? As you can see, I don't have much time. Meet you tonight at the party. My name is Wayne. Of course, we're going to do it. Oh my goodness, just give me a hug. I need it. Oh, we need it. Let me see. All right. Now take the bags. Make sure you dress very hot on for the party. So, Ben, how are you? I still go in there. Which place other than the party? Wow! Yeah. You know, I have a little Wow! I have a little bit. 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 I have a why are you biting up? What's biting you up? No, tell me. Anyway, whatever it is, please do not cross my lane. And don't you ever talk to me in that manner again. Never! And if I do, what will happen? No, tell me, what will happen? Anyway, you're just jealous. Jealous of who? Jealous of you. Like this. A two in the gate from a warehouse. Look at this, look at this idiot though. I should be jealous because of all this small, small chingon boys that you parade around the campus. I forgot to have a photo, photo. Me, chingon boys. You and I know that I move with big boys. You know that. No, you know. Big boy that you snatched. Boyfriend snatcher. Me, boyfriend snatcher. Me. Anyway, you're just suffocating with envy. I will slap the hell out of you if you insult me. Hmm? Yes! You will slap! I will slap you! 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 I will slap you!
What is it? What? Don't get up from there! Look at the way you balanced! Is this your father's sitting room? Or have you lost your mind? What nonsense! Useless man. Thank you. Here. Process this very fast and get me the money. I need it for urgent shopping. Four hundred fifty thousand naira. Hey, hey! Uh. What? Uh, Madam, this is a lot of money. Uh, it will require MD signature. Meaning what? I need a paltry four hundred fifty thousand naira from my father's company, and you're telling me about MD signature? What nonsense! Look at this one. What do you know? This is give me the money I asked you for. Okay. <laughs> Madam, oh, sorry. The, uh, when exactly do you need uh, the money? <sighs> Are you sick? Is something wrong with you? Don't worry. I'll see you soon. Oh. You're back. So quick. Yeah. Welcome. Yeah. So how did you go? Yes, just to discuss in principle about the supplies. Oh. The details will be later. It's all right. Uh, sweetheart, on my way coming in, I met Mr. Owalaka. He made me sign a voucher originated by you. So that lousy man has been crawling with that paper I gave him ever since then? Sweetheart, please. I will appeal to you not to make their work so difficult for them. How? How do you mean? Please try and abide by the procedures, especially the matter concerning money. It will help so much in accountability. Really? Yeah. So all this same one now is because of the little money I asked for my shopping. I'm not looking into your money for shopping or whatever, but what I'm saying is please follow the procedure. Then I should kneel before you and get the signature then, in my own father's company. <laughs> sometimes, sometimes, sometimes you play too much. You seem to have forgotten that you're here because of me. Do you have to remind me that always? Aren't you the one being unreasonable and arrogant? Aren't you? What are you talking about? Me. Arrogant. <laughs> me. Yes. My father made life easier for you. Courtesy of me. Instead of you being grateful, you're giving me boss attitude. How? I don't get it. Do you know what? I am done with this job. I can't take this anymore. I am tired of your humiliations. I am done. Sit yourself.
What is it? And where do you think you're going? I am leaving this job. I am done with this job. Since I started this job, I've never known peace. It's from one humiliation to another. I am going. I am quitting. And no one will stop me. So this is it. You want to leave me? You want to leave me because of this little quarrel we had? You want to disgrace me? Because I asked you for, for, for little money. Where have I gone wrong? After everything I did for you. I rejected all my suitors against my father's will because of you. Now you, you want to leave me because of this little quarrel we just had. Is that right? Is that all the love you've been professing to me? You want to leave me because of... Oh, oh, oh. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry I overreacted. But you know the pressure was too much on me from all angles. You need to see what your dad did to me the other day in front of Gateman and others. Eh? I, 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 wasn't, I wasn't idle before. I, was, I wasn't jobless. You know it. But anyway, I, I, I am sorry. Please forgive me. It's okay, my darling. It's because we are not yet fully married. By the time we get married fully, Dad will no longer interfere in our affairs. Please help me talk to him about it. But don't tell him I complained. Okay? Then you have to hasten up with the marriage plans. Okay? So that we can live our lives without interference. It's okay. I love you. I love you too, babe. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, let's go to somewhere and chill off. Okay. What do you think? Right away. <laughs> let's go. Are you good now? Yeah, baby. Sure. I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Come on. All right, let's go. Let's go. What exactly is going on? I went to the office today. You were nowhere to be found. I called your line and it was switched off. Um, so I'm sorry, I guess my battery was down. The batteries of your two phones were down. Where were you? Because I spent over one hour and no one could explain your movement. Is that how you've been running my company? Uh, no, sir. I wasn't feeling too well, so I decided to take a bed rest. What a cheap lie. What a cheap lie. When you were slaving in the bank, did you take bed rest? This is the problem of poor people. You give them an inch, they want a mile. Sorry, sir. You're now earning three times your salary in the bank with fraudulent deals behind my back. Yet, you can afford to take bed rest. Okay. Let me assume you went and took bed rest. With whose permission? Am I no longer the CEO? Of course you are, sir. You are. Just imagine. Imagine. I came to the office with three expatriates from China oh. to inspect the facilities and know how they can partner with us. But you were nowhere to be found. You were nowhere to be found. I'm sorry, sir. I'm Mr. So sorry. MD. So sorry. The MD Apatara. I don't mix business with sentiment. Listen, in law or no in law, you must play by the rules. Okay, sir. Sir, I, I'm so sorry. I promise 
this will never happen again. It better not. I don't have data. When we get to the house, I'll Google it so I can get the right off from but internet. But I've done this one. Okay, I'm done sure. this one. Yes, oh, yes, I've done good. I'll copy from you then. Okay. So this man and his assignment. Here. I don't understand. That one is kind of confusing. Um, no, so this. Okay, this one. Yeah. There, this is another. Yeah, okay, Maka, what's up? You're back. All right. Hi. I'll meet you guys in the room. Take care. Yeah. How are you? I hate that Amaka. She's so boastful and full of herself. Who does she think she is? Eh? The day I will deal with that hypocrite, let none of you stop me. Because what I will Please, do to Venza is okay. What did Amaka do to you that you're always getting angry with her? She took my boyfriend. Really? But you're still with Shegun. Who is that? Who is Shegun? Look at this one. I'm talking of a rich big boy. And you're talking of Shegun who is always broke. Oh, ah. tell me about that. Okay. There's this rich, handsome big boy I met in town. Okay. Immediately he fell in love with me. Yes. And he came to the hostel to look for me. Okay. I was not around. And Maka cornered him. Really? I'm not aware of such a guy. How would you know with a secretive holier than thou life? Well, that's really bad of Amaka. We are not supposed to backbite each other. That's not fair. I will deal with Amaka. I said I will deal with Amaka. I must take it's my okay. revenge. It's okay. I understand how you feel, okay? It's okay. You know what will happen? Once we get home this evening, I'm going to bring up the issue and we'll trash it out. No, 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 no. There's nothing to trash out. I don't want you to discuss it. As a matter of fact, I don't want her to know that I'm angry about it. Why? Are you asking? Yes, of hey. course. Hey, have you taken a very good look at me? Me, Venda, a.k.a. Venza. How will it be said that ordinary Amaka, Ochako Amaka, took a man from me, me, Venza? Oh, you want her to start feeling pompous? Hey, I took a man from Venza. No, please. Don't tell her anything. In fact, promise me you're not going to say a word to her. Promise. Then you have to promise that you stop nagging and quarreling her. If not, I'll discuss it. Okay? Mm, okay. Fine. Right, better. So let's go. Don't worry now. It's okay. Look at Amaka. It's okay. Let's go. Who is she more it. beautiful than? Or is it because it's she's okay. fair? If I want our rub cream, I'll, I'll be ah. fair. Uh -uh. It's not the same thing. How can I pick two? This is no. This all. is triangle and this is rectangle. So, this is not all. So, look, look at what, what is this? It's okay, please. Let's not start now, please. Why is it that anytime we want to play or want to make jokes, you will just start quarrelling? Why? I'm tired of both of you quarrelling every time now. Please now, this thing is getting on me. I'm so tired about it. Please, people should just stop fighting with each other. We are friends. Why can't we continue the way we used to be before? Please, remember the Bible says, to err is human and to forgive is divine. Amaka, whatever Venda has done to you. Oh, oh, oh who hold it right there? Please, Venda. Who said please. I did anything to Amaka? I'm not saying you did anything to anybody. All I just want is peace. Please, let's just be happy. Please, I don't want this fight and quarrels again. Please, it's okay. Venda, have you heard me? Okay, fine. Tina, enough said. Amaka, what about you? I've never had any problem with her. God knows I love Venda with all my heart. Okay. 
if she's ready to settle, I'm always ready. I'm here. Of course she's ready. I'm sorry, Ben. You're ready to respect me. <laughs> I love that. Oh, yeah. Wow. I'm so happy too. for you too. <laughs> <laughs> so happy. I've missed you. I've missed you. <laughs> All right. So, oh, okay. So, where, where are we? Let's <laughs> right. we'll take back our games. So, what is the latest update on the traditional wedding? Well, we've settled for 28th of October. Both traditional. And white wedding. Wow. <laughs> I mean, that's pretty close. You know, a whole lot is going to happen. It's going to be large. Mm, very large. <laughs> of course, I know that. Big man things, Abby. <laughs> <laughs> um, actually, I'm having some meeting with the family. By weekend, I'm going to update you on where to come in, you know, where to help me. I hope it's, you're ready. It's all right. I'm always here. You know I'm here for you. I know. I I'm trust you there that. for you. I trust you that. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm so happy for you at least. Your girl is a real Ajabota. Have you? Not like my, <laughs> my former vendor. <laughs> <laughs> Who is just a face me, I face to Ajabo. <laughs> anyway, just keep me posted. I will. I will. I'm always here for you. Yeah, thanks, man. Thanks, and once again, thanks. congratulations. You can say that again. We we'll hit it on that day. I bless God. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> open, open. Open. Ah. Oh, babes. Brenda, what's up? Cool. Where are you off to? You're all dressed up. The church program I told you about. Oh, that. Yeah. Okay. So how are you? Very well, thank you. Do you have anything eatable in this room? Nope. <laughs> <laughs> wow. I love. <laughs> Babe, I just got a lot. Please, I'm sorry. Let me go in. Hello? I want it to Laura. Mm, my darling. Thank you so much. Yes, I got it a lot. Sure, I did. Mm. Of course, it's more than enough. Mm. Oh, I wish I would make it. I'm going for a church program in the campus. Yes. Thank you so much. I love you too. Thank you. Did you hear that? It's for you. <laughs> Thank you, darling. Thank you so much. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Wow. Alas. I'm so happy. Baby, I'm coming. Please, let me ease myself. This is the last. It's making me breath. All right. <laughs> Sorry, babe. I kept yeah, you waiting. Ready, no Let's go. Okay. Ah, ah, I can borrow this. Of yeah. course, sure. Yeah. <laughs> After you. Okay. Put me in prayer. Oh, I'll join sure you next time. <laughs>
Hello? Ah, oh, jeez. Your voice is so romantic and lovely. How are you, sir? Please, me, I know who I'm speaking with. My name is Venda. Well, my friends call me Venza, as in Venza Jeep, because of my well-shaped, perfect, sexy waist. <laughs> so, Chief, I got your number from Amaka. She didn't give it to me, though. But I heard her saying that she's tired of you after she got the money you sent to her. She said that you disgust her. That she's just there because of the money you lavish on her. <laughs> Hello, I think you're speaking with the wrong person. Sir, I know you will not believe me. I know. But I'm telling you the truth. Amaka hates even the ground you step on. She hates you. You disgust her. That's what she said. Eh? She's just, she's just eating your money, collecting money from you and maintaining one stupid, useless court guy on campus. So I, I'm telling you all this because I'm a good person. I'm a nice person. I don't like the way she's treating you. Hello, sir. Are you there? <sighs> okay. So don't you think I deserve some accolades? For this privileged information. <laughs> oh, thank you so much. Uh, and what's that your name again? Oh, my name is Venda. Well, my friends call me Venza, as in Venza Jeep, because of my sexy, perfect waist. Eh? Don't worry, sir. When you see me, you want to be a <laughs> So I'm so beautiful. I don't even know what you're doing with Amaka. Amaka is not fine. Sir, you know what? If you have WhatsApp, send me, let me, let me send you some of my pictures, two of my crazy pictures. Eh? Can you call Godi? <laughs> Please do. Uh, Please do. <laughs> hey, fresh bread straight from bakery. Yes, sir. Let me send, if you don't mind, sir. Please, let me send you some of my pictures so that you know you'll be wasting your time with that stupid, ugly amaka. Uh, no, not at all. <laughs> Vicky. Oh, sir, it's not Vicky. It's Venda, a.k.a. Venza. <laughs> uh, oh, Venza. I like the car. You like the car? Ah, oh, sir, you will love my waist. <laughs> you will love my waist. <laughs> sir, you know what? I'm available for you any day, any time, any minute. Eh? <laughs> okay, so let, let me quickly send you some pictures. Eh? <laughs> Add me on WhatsApp. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yes, baby. I see you on WhatsApp. Okay. A hot pictures, hot picture. No, this one is not hot enough. Oh yeah. Set. Let me look for the one that my waist is showing well, very well. Uh -huh. This one is showing my waist very well. Set. Send. Let me do for another one where my Waist is showing very well. Send. Hello, Brenda. Hi. <laughs> She's beautiful. <laughs> pictures and they wow <laughs> it's okay Hello, sir. Yo, baby. 
I've seen your beautiful pictures and uh, indeed you are a queen. Oh, I told you, sir. <laughs> Hope you saw the one with my protruding waist. <laughs> I'm, I'm sure you want us to meet. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. I want us to see. I can't wait. It's all right. I will send you the address of where we'll meet. Is tomorrow okay by you? Yes, tomorrow is okay. Today is okay. Anytime, anywhere, any day. I'm, I'm available, sir. I'm available. Oh, you take a taxi and I will take care of everything. <laughs> okay, sir. I love you, sir. <laughs> That's my baby. You're welcome. <laughs> <laughs> Baby! Hey! Um, okay, where are you going to dress up like this? I am going to... I am going to see someone. A relation. Yes. Ah, uh, okay. Relation. Perfect. Uh, okay, no, 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 no problem. Uh, uh, baby, I've got good news for us. Okay. You can't believe this. My uncle called from California and he said, I will be coming to the States for my PhD. Can you imagine that? Isn't that incredible? Incredible, incredible. Right? Incredible. That is my ultimate dream. Check out my plans. By next year, I graduate. And no, get out to USA, get a job there. And the, the following year, I'm back to Nigeria making my wife. And finally, you and I will look to America. Isn't that beautiful? Um, 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 Shogu, please, I, I will see you when I come back, okay? Really? I have to hurry, yes. It's obvious you're not excited about this, are you? Me? I'm excited. Ha ha ha, come here, I'm excited. I'm very much excited. I I'll see you later, okay? My aunt is waiting for me, I will see you, okay? You've never believed in me. She has never believed in my dreams. I think it's high time I leave her. Let her go. So that I can move on.
You're welcome. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. You look beautiful. Thank you. Come on. Thank you. <laughs> Please, make yourself comfortable. <laughs> Thank you, sir. <sighs> You're welcome. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. You're really an angel. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, sir. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Is that <a> good one? <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> um, a toast to my angel. Yes. Cheers. <laughs> you're such a beautiful girl. <laughs> and you're so romantic. <laughs> <laughs> you're welcome. <laughs> How about your parents? My parents, ha. Huh. It's only my mother. My father threw us out when we were little. And got married to one witch like that. Ever since then, I don't have anything to do with him. He's a useless, foolish man. He's the reason I'm suffering like this now. Huh. You have siblings? Yes. My other brother is in Kano. He's a trader in Kano. That one. He's foolish. He hardly comes back home since he married one or one day from that side. Nobody eats his one naira, his ten kobo. And my senior sister, hey, that one is the most foolish person I have seen in my life. She did not go to school. She just got married to one useless man and can, you can imagine at the age of 24, she already has five kids. Five! You can imagine that. She's very stupid. Foolish. Mm -hmm. And my younger brother. Hey! That one. You hear the smell. He's just doing conductor up and down and smoking Igbo, Indian him, everything. I'm sure he, he has gone mad. He's a forgotten issue. Wasted. Wow. What a family. Mm. Yes, sir. What a family. That's why I want to make a difference. I want to make it in life. I want to touch money. Eh? Poverty is a disease. Yeah. Poverty and ignorance are not good at all. Yes, sir. It's not good at all. So I, I, I'm here. I want you to help me, sir. Uh, uh, help me. Help my ministry because I'm the one taking care of myself in school. And it's not funny. It's really tough on me. Sir, please, I need your assistance. Oh, please. It's okay. I, I will try my best for you. Huh? Thank <coughs> Excuse you. Excuse me. Chief. Hello. Ha! Double chief. Chief, chief. How are we, my brother? Exactly. Um, I am busy right now, maybe. <laughs> okay. <laughs> ah, Chief. The wine is so nice. <laughs> um, <laughs> well, like I said before, I will help you, but you must be a good girl. Of course, sir. I will do anything and everything you want me to do. And I will equally give it to you very well. Anytime, <laughs> any day. Um, by being <laughs> a good girl, I mean, you must be honest and sincere. Not being dubious, jealous, mischievous, uh, saucy and bitchy. No, 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 sir. I'm not like that. No. Ah, go for Really? Me. I'm not like that. No. <laughs> but your friends said that you, you're like that. That you quarrel, backbite, and blackmail others. Me. My friends. Do you know any of my friends? Of course I do. Sir, so you weren't discussing me with Amaka. I thought this is I thought this was supposed to be between us. <laughs> It was not only Amaka I discussed with you, I was even discussed with my son. Your son? 
I don't understand. <laughs> well, my son knows you. He likes you, but not anymore. Yes. My son loves you. Until he found out you're blackmailing my daughter. Your daughter? <laughs> yeah. Ah, I want a tutor. <laughs> I can see you are having a good time. Yeah, <laughs> with my new catch. <laughs> she snatched me from Amaka. <laughs> really? <laughs> ah, Venda, you snatched Chief from his own daughter? <laughs> Oh, my baby. That's my baby. My Yolo Popo. My last bunny. Mm -hmm. <laughs> How do you? I'm fine. <laughs> oh, my God. <laughs> please, please. What is going on here? You got it all wrong, girlfriend. Dan and I are your siblings. And Chief Edward here, on one need to know, the sugar daddy is our father. Oh, wow. Gimbo. <laughs> um, Benza, please sit down. Sit down, hold on. Sit down. Listen, Brenda, I didn't bring you here to humiliate you, but to help you because you really need help. You appear as if the world is against you, but you are actually against the world, quarreling, condemning, and fighting everyone else, including your family. I heard about you constantly harassing and antagonizing my daughter and I was not happy about it she is my last baby nobody jokes with her nobody crosses her and goes free but I forgive you and my advice is that you want to make anything out of this life, you first work on your character. Take this for your transport. It's twenty thousand naira. Take. Come on, take. It's from the bottom of my heart. What about what is going on? Come on. Thank you, sir. You're welcome. P please, sir. I I'm, I'm, I'm sorry. I'm truly sorry. Amaka, please forgive me. I don't know what came over me. I misinterpreted the whole thing. Please, I'm sorry. Please. It's okay. At least you couldn't snatch me from the sugar daddy. <laughs> Good luck, Benda. fell in love with this character? No, Dad. I met her just once. Once? There is nothing. She even gave me a wrong number. Can you imagine? <laughs> Boy, you have to be careful. All that greeters are not gold. Sure, Dad. I guess I will consult you next time before trying to pick a woman. <laughs> <laughs> you better do. <laughs> Thank you so much, Daddy. That's my baby. Oh, Thank wow. you. <laughs> uh, 
How far have you gone with the preparation? So we are progressing. The invitation cards are ready. And this is the sample. Okay. This is lovely. You have taste and class. <laughs> Thank you, sir. How many copies did you print so far? Oh, 200 copies. That is not enough. We are talking about my daughter's wedding here. My staff strength is more than 500. I have friends and associates all over the world that will attend. My friend, I advise you to print 2,000 more copies to be on the safe side. Um, so I, I, um, I, it's all right, it's all right, uh, it will be done. So which venue have you chosen for your reception? Oh, the Lagoon Restaurant. No, God forbid. That is way too below my class. The New Age Stadium will be more like it. Huh? That is very appropriate. Go now and arrange for it immediately. Okay, sir. Okay. <sighs> Thank you, sir. James. Oh. James. Yes, Come here. Oi, mom. Yes, hon. Good day. Oh. <laughs> I'm good. Welcome. I I brought the Ashibi materials. Really? Really? Yeah. Oh, that's <laughs> nice. <laughs> <Isn't it good? sighs> Here we go. Mm. I, I hope um, this material is not for my daughter's ashebi. No, no, don't you like it? <laughs> this is, this is Ankara. Super yes. Print. Yes. <laughs> we are talking about my daughter's marriage, my daughter's ashebi, and not yours. I know. I spent so much time in the market looking for the high quality. Uh, you spent is... a lot of time doing nothing? Uh, no, ma You spent time buying nothing? You went to the market to buy this cheap statue of pure water? No. So my daughter's a shabby. This is of high quality, Lolo. What quality? You should have brought the money. So we will go and choose what we want based on our class. Lolo, but we discussed it before. But what? You see, babes, now you have made my mother angry. Look at what you went and bought. You could have gotten other better materials, like hand cut, polish and pike, not, not Ankara. And the money is great for that matter, babes. This is not worth it. It's not. When I ask you to go get them. Baby, but you know I have been busy with so many other things around. You know that. <sighs> babes. Okay, now, what happens to this? It's quite unfortunate though, but I, I promised the modelers babies of some outfit. So, I have no choice but to give them this. Huh? Yes, but th that's what I'm going to do. I'm, I'm obviously not going to wear these babes. Do you know how much I bought this? Mommy, I'm coming! See what you're going to do for me. You have to drive home. I'll call you later. Then pick it and send it to them. Alright, babes, I love you. Bye. Just, just like that? Yeah, babes. Mommy! <sighs> Oh, God. Ah. Ah. Chief, um, please uh, make, make you fast. I'm in a hurry. Oh, okay. Chief, please, I need your help. I'm going to go. 
I need about 25 million naira for this wedding. I, I don't have such money. You don't have such money? No. So in all your years as a banker, you couldn't save ordinary 25 million naira? Even in your new position, where you practically determine your own salary, and all the deals you do behind my back. Chief, I don't do that. Shut up, my friend. You don't do any deals. I decide to ignore it because you are my son-in-law. Proposed. I'm sorry, Chief. Sorry. I don't do such monkey business. You have to foot the bill as the man. I will support you with the dowry. You do not. That is when I will settle my daughter in a very big way. Okay. But for now, you have to do your thing. Is that clear? Yes, sir. I don't believe in pampering people, especially my fellow men. You have to work out your own salvation. Haven't I assisted you enough? You, you have. You have. You have. Let me warn you. Do not disgrace my daughter. Is that clear? It's clear, sir. Now move it. Thank you, sir. You bankers are so stingy. Driver! Driver! Come, let's go. Brother, you've not been all cases this weekend. Are you okay? I'm fine. It's just work stress. Stress? I thought this work is less stressful than the former one. Yes, it is. But in a way, you know, we're still building up. Yeah, but I'm fine. I'm good. Okay. Uh, your lunch is ready. Lunch? I'm not hungry. Not. But you've not eaten anything since today. Maybe you have malaria. Gozi. Malaria. It's okay. Let's go. Let me go eat. Lunch. Let's go. I'm fine. Look, I just googled some wedding gown on my mm. phone and look at the one I got. Isn't it extremely beautiful? Wow, this is nice. Yes, this is it. it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous, I like it. I like it I like too. It, yeah. So, once we travel to the UK, we'll go to their shopping mall and then get it. We're gonna get it. Remember, babes, we are flying BA, not all this cheap airline. Mm, no problem, no problem. But remember, I'm coming to pick you early in the morning so you get prepared. Okay. To the we embassy? To, yeah, we need to go to the embassy and get our visa. Of course. Mm? I'm certain about that. Okay, fine. Then since we are going to go to the embassy in the morning, why don't we leave now? I mean, we have tried for the day. So I think you're right. Leave me tomorrow. Come on, let's. So, 6 a.m. 6 a.m. You should know that. No African time. You should know that. I kill you. You should know that. Should know that. <laughs> okay, baby. Come on, let's go.
is going on? Nasunto has not stayed out this long before. Oh God, where is my brother? Goodness. Is yeah. switched off? Mom, all his lights are switched off. What's the meaning of this? Uh, this is past seven. This is most unusual of him. Uh, are you sure he's okay? I wouldn't know, Mom. Santo has never kept me waiting. Not on such occasion. Oh. Maybe I should go to his house. He might be sick or something. And something must be wrong, Mom. He, he's never like this. I think you're right. In that case, let me get the driver to drop you over. Okay, Mom. That'll be fine. But make sure you call me as soon as you get there. Of course I will. Please, I'll just... You, you have to be careful too. Okay, Mom. Let me call the driver. Oh, gosh. No, but I don't know. Where is Santo? Where is he? I, I don't know. I've not seen him since yesterday. What do you mean you've not seen him? You mean to tell me that he did not sleep here? No, I thought he was at your place. Oh my goodness! His phones are switched off. Uh, I've been calling him too. Where could he have gone to? Has anything happened to my brother? I cannot understand this. What is really happening? I mean, what has happened to my husband? I mean, what's the meaning of all this? Since morning? Oh no. My enemies and bad people have got me. Oh. Calm down, sweetheart. Your father will be coming back tomorrow. He will find out what is going on. Okay? <laughs> Mommy, this is so unusual of him. He's not always like this. Since morning, I have not heard from my husband. How? Wait. M Mommy, do you think something bad has happened to him? Mm -mm. Do you think he's dead? Or, or, or maybe, maybe he had an accident and died? Or he's at the hospital or something? Maybe we should go check at the hospital, Mommy. Sweetheart, calm down. How many hospitals do we check? Then we should go to the police and make a report. You can't report for a missing person in less than 24 hours. Oh, no. Before you could go to the police to report for a missing person, you give it 24 hours. Me, why are all this happening to me? Just Mommy, calm down. I am not concentrating on anything I'm doing right now. and I'm not focused. I don't know why. Santo, where down. are you? We're supposed to be going into the embassy for the visa and then buy ticket and travel to London for my wedding gown and stuffs. But now I cannot even find my husband. I mean, the whole thing is he's making me so uncomfortable. Let me just keep trying. So uncomfortable now. Calm down. No. Let me, no, hold, let me hold this. Same thing. Let me hold it. You have to calm down. 
Okay, everything will be fine. Mom, it's not easy. It's not easy for me to calm down. It's, my, my wedding is around the corner. I could barely reach my husband. That... Calm down. Stop, Stop panicking so much. I'll, I'll try again. <laughs> Allow this phone to rest. It's okay. You will be fine. Okay. Okay. I don't understand what Manchester United is playing. Eh? Since they brought that boy from uh, I don't know where, that paints his head yellow, blue, and black. Plain nonsense. I need a quanka. Unknown number. Uh, hello, Kuima. Hello? Uh, it's me, Ngozi. Ngozi? Which, which Ngozi? Yes, your own Ngozi. My niece. <laughs> uh, you, you, you have a phone? Yes, it's a small phone for the son to give to me. So he can communicate with me anytime. You know he's a very busy person. Hey, yeah, wonderful. Look at life, oh. Look at my small Ngozi now has a phone. And she can operate a phone. That is wonderful. That is wonderful. Yes, Uncle. But Uncle, there is a problem. Huh? Eh? Problem? Uh, Uncle, I've no more heard from Brother Sumto since. Ever since he left for the office on Monday, I've not heard from him since then. Uh, uh, two days? Uh, um, uh, have you called his numbers? Yes, but they're not, he's not responding. They are switched off. What? Uh, um, this is strange. I don't know. Uh, Ngozi, uh, have you told anybody about this? No, I have not. You're the only one I've told and I don't want to tell mommy. Aha. Uh -huh. Please don't discuss this with anybody. Do you hear me? Uh, I wouldn't want uh, mother to hear this. No, she's not feeling fine. Um, don't worry. I, I, I will do something about this. Let me make some contacts and um, see what is going on. Two days? Uncle, you can call me back on this line. Yes, I will, I will, I will. Uh, don't worry, don't worry. Maybe he went on outside work or something, okay? Uh, so, uh, just relax, eh? Uh, he will come back. Bye-bye. But I'm so, so where are you? So where are you? <laughs> what is happening? Two days. My own brother. I told Sumto about this man the day we went for the introduction. The moment I saw the man, I said, no, 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 no. Hey, I want your way go. This is a money ritual man. Are you sure they have not used my brother for ritual? Hey! He wants to marry a big man's daughter. Ngwano. Ngwano, oh, okay, go. Emmanuel, Emmanuel, come to Olivia, 
What were you telling me on phone? Honey, we've not seen Somto for two days now. He was supposed to go to the embassy with our daughter to collect their visa. But we've not seen him for two days now. And his phones are switched off. Where is Oled? She's in her room. She's been crying since. What is the meaning of this? Have you made any report to the police? I was waiting for you to come back, honey. Hello, Commissioner. Good evening. How are you doing tonight? Fine. Commissioner, I have a serious problem on my hands now. Mm. My son-in-law, who was about to wed my daughter next month, has been missing since Monday. Yes, two days now. I was away in Abuja for a business meeting. Yes. Yeah, he was on seat at work till the end of work on Monday. Well, I suspect kidnap. Some desperate idiots have kidnapped him, hoping to make some ransom demand. I will come over. I will come immediately. Thank you. Go be Yes, honey. I will rush and see the commissioner at once. But before I do that, let me go and see you all later. Okay. Whoever did this will see the other side of me. Kidnap my son-in-law. You have come to the end of your road. The end of your road and the end of your bus stop. Uh -huh. Hello, uh, Ngozi? Uncle, I'm so scared here. I cannot stay here any longer. I want to come back to the village. Uh, about what again? What again happened? Do you know that police people came here yesterday asking me all kinds of questions? Ha! Huh. Police, what? What, what are they saying this time? Oh, I don't know. I'm so scared. Uh, uh, just calm down. I actually called to tell you that I'm coming over to the city. Ah, when? I, I am planning to come tomorrow. Uh, I, I would have uh, liked to come today, but uh, I had to see my pastor, the senior pastor, over this matter. And he told me that uh, uh, God is in control. You hear? No, 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 please come today. I cannot stay here any longer. I'm so scared. I cannot stay here alone. Please come today. It, it, it's all right. It's all right. Eh? Um, uh, the Lord is your strength. You hear me? Just calm down. Stay indoors. Don't go out. Don't talk to anybody. Don't open door to anybody. Even if it's police, just stay indoors. Do you hear me? I hope you have food to eat. Yes, yes, yes. Eh? Don't worry. The Lord is your strength. Inugo? Oh, it's a bon one. Sorry. Oh, eh, some to na e long walk around. Nda jigo ya gwa ogwe ego. But kanaga. Kanaga. Hi. Okay, uncle. My brother, that is the problem I am going through right now. No, they have not called. We have visited several hospitals in town just in case he was involved in a car accident. But we can't find the young man. We have reported officially to the police. Yet, nothing. It is mind-puzzling. 
Thank you very much, my good friend. Of course, you know I will keep you posted of any development. Thank you. Thank you. Hey, Mr. Walaka, shut up! I said I'm coming. You're always whining like a woman. Listen, I told you the MD is not around. I am the CEO, and I'm coming to solve the problem. Okay? And listen, don't call my number again. You'll see me very shortly. Okay? take the decision because I can't continue deserving myself. Olido, please, I beg you, help me to ask your father for forgiveness because I am gone to a far place to continue a new life and I urge you to move on with your own life. I know you love me. I love you too. But I cannot continue. The whole thing is, is killing me. I hope you understand. Please. Just take care of yourself. Bye. No. Blood of Jesus, anywhere he is now, but I cover him with the blood of Jesus. That's what will happen to him in Jesus' name. Amen. God, please. 
brother so sorry you please go back oh god please help my brother wherever he is now i don't want anything to happen to him i cover him with the blood of jesus hello hello who is this yes yes i'm at home here's my brother's house I shouldn't go out. But what is at least happening? Hello? Where did you know this boy from? Who is his father? Eh? Look at me! Look at my wife! All the Ashebi, all the invitations, all the news. All the news everywhere that Oduze's daughter is getting married. Now this. Oh, I will finish that boy once I catch him. Catch him, I will. Now you see why I don't want you associating with a pauper. They have nothing to show, no decorum, nothing to protect. Huh? Listen, wipe your tears. Don't worry. This young man has touched the tail of a tiger. And I will make sure he is devoured. Oh no, It's all your fault. All I do, it is all your fault. Hello, Commissioner. Thank God you called. I've been expecting your call. You remember that boy I told you that worked for me? My MD? He is a fraud. All that talk about kidnap is a frame-up. He duped me of millions of naira and they looked. I want you to put up a manhunt on him and fish him out wherever he is. Also, put up a bounty of five million naira on his head. I am coming immediately with the money. Thank you. No one messes with Chief Odunze and goes scot free. I will show that boy the other side of midnight. Now, go back upstairs and rest. Tell your mother I am on my way to see the commissioner. I will handle this. Go upstairs now. for me. I've always known that you have been lying to me all along. Where's your brother? I don't know where my brother is. You know where he is? You were a liar. Now stop talking. Where is Sonto? I don't know. I've lost you know from him since Papi. If you don't tell me where he is, I'm going to cut off your ear and feed it to you to eat. Where is your brother? I don't know. And what about his friend Frank? Where is Frank? What is his phone number? Start calling it immediately. Now! I don't know where he lives and I don't know his phone number. <laughs> you don't know what? <laughs> you don't know what? I don't know his phone number. Get up. Get up. You, you, you slimy, corny witch. <laughs> I've always known. From the very first day I saw you, I knew you were going to, you were going to spoil things for me. <laughs> now start talking. Where is your brother? I don't know anything about this. Shut up! I am very 
very, very sure that you must have convinced him to do what he's doing right now and you're pretending like you do not know anything about it. I know you don't like me, but I do not like you either. I hate you so much and I hate everything you represent. Don't worry. When all this is over, I will so deal with you. Because only God knows that I can never live with your type. I can't can live with your type. No, I cannot live with your type. You, you. Oh my goodness. I'll kill you. Evil, evil. Bastard. Oh, little. Thank God you're here. Oh, please. Just, just, just say that greeting. Say it. Now you have to take me to where your friend is right now and just a minute because I know that you planned all this with him. He couldn't have done it all by himself. Only though, I know nothing. You liar. You are a blatant liar. You cannot tell me that you do not know where your friend is. He couldn't have done it all by himself. Your best friend for that matter. How? Listen, I have been in Portugal for the past one week running a project. I equally saw the, 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 the picture of the missing person on the newspaper and that's what prompted the urgency of my coming. I'm also here to find out what is happening from his sister. Please, pardon me. When last did you see him?
Service. I want to clean the room. Hello? Hello, who is there? Hmm. This person will not agree open door. Okay. Thank God, this one is a minus one for me. I can go rest. Lado. You don't want the doctor to see you. You don't want to take the drugs recommended. And you don't want to eat your food. What do you want? Tell daddy to remove the bounty placed on some doctor's head. If not, I will not take my medication. I will not leave this house. I will remain right here. Olido, you want to go back to that magnumenia pimp? 
Is that what you want to do? But I'm not going back to him. But I just want you to let him go. Do not hurt him. Let him just go. Let him just go, okay? If you don't do that, I am not taking my medication. I will remain here like this. I rather it's die. okay. Honey, please. Please, for our daughter's sake. Okay. It is very heavy for me to do this, but you know for you, I'll do anything. But make one promise to me. That you will never go back to that unscrupulous banking misfit. Call soon to. Before now, Father, I have decided not to go back to him. So I have no reason going back to him after everything he has done. But what I'm begging you is to just let him go. Do not hurt him, please. That's all I'm asking you. Alright? Don't worry yourself. I will. Okay. I will let it go. Ah, I'll put off the bounty. I'll put off the chase. Let him fly like a kite. No problem. Thank, Thank you. you. As long as you're happy. Thank you. Thank you. So can I can I be bring your drugs now? Or call the doctor? You can call him. Thank you, honey. Mm. She'll call the doctor. Yes. No. Oh. 
Some with much pride, power and 